Welcome back to a brand new video, Moon Family. I got a really good one for you all today, and I'm excited for this one. I got your week NDD, and we got another one tomorrow. We're covering four stocks today, including ILUS, CYBL, CEI, and the new big board swing play at the end of the video that could run just like CEI did recently. If you missed out on that, watch the end of this video. All I ask from you is to drop a like on this video right now. It takes a quick second. Go down there, drop a like, and let me know in the comments what you're doing this weekend. I want to connect with you all in the comments. I read pretty much every single comment that you guys leave down there. Even if not, I'm not responding, I'm reading it. And there is a link in the description to join the private Discord, get all of these runners early. You know how we did it with Eyeless for NCYBL, and there are almost 26,000 of you with the notification bell turned on. Make sure to have it on. I will be on all of the runners during this upcoming OTC penny stock bull run that is inevitable. First stock we're covering today, ticker CYBL 0445. Today, 6% on the previous trade. I think 240 44 million dollar market cap and Cyberlux already has contracts with government agencies including the Department of Defense and let me remind you of that by popping up on the screen a picture of one of their 10 million dollar contracts that was established in 2006 just to prove man they've had these contracts for a long time and this company is far from done after those contracts as we all have been witnessing they keep delivering on promises they make and I don't see them slowing down on news anytime soon we covered this on the channel at 0008 for the first time, which would now bring us to 5,500% gains since the first CYBL video, which was seven months ago. And like I said, hop in that Discord because we're about to get back to these 5,500% gainers. Let's go over this golden press release. I call it a golden press release because, man, this is an absolute gem. And it was put out yesterday by CYBL 10 minutes before the market closed. So a lot of new eyes will be looking at it over the weekend. Cyberlux and Straight Group partner to deliver flight eye drone solutions and Cyberlux infrastructure products to U.S. agencies and commercial markets. And Strike Group is a world leader in sustainment logistics, infrastructure delivery, and material sourcing for U.S. agencies, the Department of Defense, and the commercial contracting marketplace with expertise in distribution and infrastructure delivery. So sounds a lot like Cyberlux when we're talking about the Department of Defense. Strike Group helped deliver aircraft modernization and mission system integration and Strike Group manages worldwide logistic programs for the U.S. Marine Corps and services for federal agencies and for military government federal customers. Strike Group was founded by a retired U.S. Naval officer and Strike Group will provide contracting and delivery support for the Cyberlux Flight Eye Drone Solution products and infrastructure products, including contracting and access to senior government decision makers in the emerging unmanned aircraft system marketplace and access access to specific U.S. agency requirements, and Strike Group will provide solution sales support for all U.S. government agencies. So this sounds a lot like CYBL. We're getting involved with the government, U.S. agencies, Department of Defense, and with this channel delivery partnership, Cyberlux plans to introduce advanced solutions in both the UAS and infrastructure product space and expects to drive more than $20 million in contract revenue during the first three years of this re relationship with Strike Group and the CEO of CYBL said we have been working with the Strike Group team to announce this exciting channel delivery partnership. We are so excited about their Department of Defense reach and from an infrastructure standpoint, Strike Group has ongoing products with the federal, state, and local areas where Cyberlux products are a perfect fit and we are now positioned to take advantage of the coming infrastructure spending. And with the recent passage of a trillion dollar infrastructure bill in the Senate, Infrastructure plays could start getting hot and CYBL is here at the perfect time because their strike group is ready to deliver contracts with our infrastructure pipeline. We have an immediate fit for LED street lighting and the solar power products and our team looks forward to working with Cyberlux to serve this market within the Department of Defense and federal government agencies. And the biggest news in this PR that I did not mention yet because I wanted to save it so I can give you detailed information on this, that strike group has an L3 integrated system group partner. And this was in the PR. L3 is a $44 billion company called L3 Harris Technologies and a $223 stock price traded on the New York Stock Exchange as ticker LHX. And now with this news, Cyberlux has connections to them 
through Straight Group. And here is a look at one of Straight Group's warehouses. It's a massive facility and now CYBL has access to some of this. And just two days ago, CYBL was featured on Yahoo Finance. And Yahoo Finance, you know, they put out some big pieces as 10 best micro cap stocks to invest in. And Cyberlux is right at the top of the article. So right when you click on that article, the first stock you see is ticker CYBL. And they gave a bullish review on the company because a lot of the times these are bearish. But now we got a bullish review. The company's operating and high growth areas with products that have a rising demand for the U.S. Air Force, National Guard Special Operations, and the U.S. Army. And the companies that were grouped together in this article with CYBL are mostly NASDAQ stocks with multiple dollar stock prices, including INMB, which is a $20 stock. It was number nine on the list. Remember, CYBL is number 10, so you got number nine right here, number eight with a $2 stock, number seven with a $3 stock, and the fact that CYBL has the lowest price per share out of everybody on this list makes it very, very attractive for people just now reading this article. And on top of all this great news, just like Fern, CYBL also has an upcoming acquisition, which should be announced in two to four weeks, since it has already been two weeks since this tweet came out stating that the next acquisition will be in four to six weeks. So now we knock down two weeks, it's in two to four weeks. Next stock we got on the list, ticker ILUS, 38 cent right now, $475 million market cap. ILUS has been on a massive run since we've been pounding the table on it since a four to seven cent range. And in that range, I was still saying that this is number one long in the OTC market market, my conviction is still the same. And look at where we are now. That's why you have to have strong conviction in a stock to hold it long term. And I got some big news to cover today that will be very bullish going into next week. But first, I want to give you a key level that we need to break and a key level of support that we need to hold that could accelerate us into the next leg higher. So a break at the top trend line at 40 cents will Firstly, indicate a stronger rate of rising. Given the current short-term trend, the stock is expected to rise 124% during the next three months with a 90% possibility of a hold between 34 cent and 91 cent. And at the end of the three months period, now take this with a grain of salt because nobody, not even the best chartist in the world can predict exactly where a stock will go. But if we are able to break and hold above the 40 cent mark, I mean, we broke it multiple times. We just weren't able to hold above it and create a support on that level. There is much higher chance that we can move much higher and we do have good support at the 37 cent level so if we do move down a bit watch for the bounce on the 37 cent mark and now we did get news just today they said we know you have been anticipating news there are many moving parts to releasing news and issuing a pr including legal approvals thank you for your patience it has been a great week closing deals and securing contracts news on monday with the hashtags acquisitions and USA. We did expect to see news last week, but I am completely fine with a small delay because all this really does is build the anticipation and seeing how they use the hashtag USA and acquisitions makes me believe this will be US acquisition news. From a PR on September 13th, Ilus explained what they are working on in the US and this news right here that we're about to hear on Monday will most likely be the completion of some of this information. Ilus is in the final stage of due diligence and purchasing negotiations for four potential acquisitions in the US and two of these acquisitions have provisionally agreed purchase offers in place and the ILIS strategy is to acquire new technology which complements its existing technology. They are planning to establish a new distribution center and new manufacturing facility in the US. They are currently in the process of acquiring a profitable distribution center with a comprehensive range of existing products. They do have exclusive distribution agreements already in place and already revenue being generated and they are planning to acquire manufacturing capability in the US for its existing firefighting vehicle and pump technology through two more U.S. acquisitions. So there are a lot of U.S. acquisitions and deals and facilities that are going to be completed very soon. So overall, we are on Newswatch Monday and all of next week as we could have multiple PRs coming for ILIS next week. Next stock, we're covering ticker CEI, $2 right now, 7% on the previous trading day. Like I've been saying since we covered CEI at 60 cent for the first time on the channel only a few weeks ago, the swing is still on. And recently I've been saying it's on in a big way because of all the recent news in terms of revenue and carbon capture height. Now, I have another big board swing play to introduce on the channel that we will run on the channel alongside CEI. And I told you, I will only introduce a new big board swing play because we're focusing on the penny stock bull run right now, but I will introduce you a new big board swing play if it's one that has a good price and a great opportunity. And I see this as 
one of the best opportunities I've seen in a while. But before I give you that play, let's go over some CEI news. Let's go over these CEI block deals. And the importance of these blocks is block deals give you an idea of where big money is moving. And there's been some big, big blocks for ticker CEI, and especially on September 24th, which was yesterday, and there was a block of 600,000 shares at 191 worth 1 million. There was a block of 1.4 million shares at $1.95 worth 2.8 million. And there was a big block of 2.7 million shares worth at, at $2.22 worth six million dollars and a block of 1.1 million shares at 226 worth 2.6 million. A block trade is a single order for very large number of securities. And this is kind of just giving us an idea of where big money is flowing and what stocks have big money flowing into them. So big institutional money is involved with CEI. And this article was posted yesterday titled US airlines are planning to unnecessarily burn 20,000 tons of carbon dioxide per day. But the reason this is so bullish for CEI because they just recently signed a carbon capture license for all of Canada and parts of the US making it a carbon capture play and this is yet again bringing CEI more into the spotlight and there was another bullish article posted yesterday on CEI titled Camber Energy Extension Higher Likely. Now here is the new big board swing play. I mean I already know this has a lot of hype on it but I wanted to bring it to my subscribers attention because of the opportunity it presents. It's 68 cents right now and it was only up 15% on the previous trading day and I think it could have been up a lot more based on the news that I'm about to show you. So last time penny stocks were overall hot, this one ran to nearly $4 as a meme stock. It's now sitting at only 68 cents and the fact that it was a meme stock previously just there's already a lot of eyes on it and there's already a lot of retail investors in this one and it still has a high interest with these retail investors and the fundamentals now are much better than the previous run when it was simply just a a meme stock. Will we have the same price, price action as CEI? I mean, it definitely could based on what I'm about to show you. Naked Brand Group provides update to chairman's address from 2021 annual meeting of shareholders. So this is ticker NAKD, by the way. I provided an update on the status of our plans to find a merger or acquisition partner. And now Naked has an expanded balance sheet with a net cash position of $270 million for Naked Brand. So they could get, in reality, a massive acquisition with all the money they have. And after extensive searching and due diligence, we believe we have found a disruptive opportunity in the clean energy sector. And you know how hot clean energy is right now. I mean, CEI is in this and look how hot they are. Due diligence on both sides is progressing and we believe the business combination will reward our patient shareholders and the company that they're about to acquire is a market leader with cutting edge patented technology and the path to a definitive agreement is in sight. So they are planning, you know, an acquisition very soon in the clean energy sector. I'm all about giving you all the best opportunity to make gains and I see Naked as a huge opportunity to make some massive gains just like when I saw CEI. Expect more updates in the future on ticker NAKD and make sure you have that notification bell on tomorrow and tune into Sunday's video because I will have a new OTC stock that I will introduce on the channel that is in the double zeros. And before you leave, just remember, drop a like on this video, comment down below and join the Discord family. The link to the Patreon is down below. Peace.